It's the final few seconds before the lights go out and the race to the podium begins. You know this battle will be won off the track as well as on it. You've studied your tactics, anticipated every move like a grand master. You've researched and analyzed, modified and fine-tuned to perfection. You have honed your instincts to give you an edge over your rivals. Your drivers focused, your team ready. The championship in the balance. First past the checkered flag, the goal. Epic victory or ultimate failure. Welcome back F1 Manager family to another F1 Manager video. And we're on our juniors account and we're gonna be doing our Turkish GP. So yeah, we're gonna be going into the challengers division as we are not yet in contenders. So challengers division it is. All right. So the channel is finally at 5K subs. We are now on our way. We are halfway to the 10K mark. Really appreciate all you guys who have subscribed to the channel for all your support. And yeah, let's get straight into this video. Remember to subscribe and turn on your post notifications. Also leave a like on the videos. All right. So we're using Kimi level five here and Lewis Hamilton level two. Uh, we've unlocked Rojan level eight who is a little bit better than Lewis Hamilton level 2 so we will be using Grosjean from time to time as a matter of fact we should be using Grosjean right now as it's going to be a dry start we're using this tune uh, which I always been using for my juniors GP uh, I've come to find out that this tune is uh, the best tune that we can possibly get uh, what we can do to increase 2 power uh there as the power to grip ratio is what 33 percent so it's one third uh when you put it so one uh one power equals three grip if you look at it that way yeah so one power equals three grip so right now you can see two power for six grip and that's equal to basically the same uh, I prefer to keep the extra grip though over the extra power as the grip will allow the car to stick to the track more and give you a faster lap. Alright, so we're going to be using Kimi and Grosjean there for our dry races and we're going to be using Lewis Hamilton for our wet races. Alright, let's get straight into this. Wait, let me, let me, let me, let me look real quick. On the level of my Sergio Perez level 5 as we have been testing on the main account so he's nowhere nowhere uh, near ready to go and, and drive probably if he was like level 6 then I would have used him over uh, Grosjean as we've been testing and he seems to be the better driver for Russia let's just chance it if we don't qualify today, we can qualify tomorrow in this account. So we're going to use Perez uh, just to see. But Alban is way down. We're going to use Alban. Mm, I don't want to risk it. Let's go with Grosjean. Doesn't make sense to risk it. Let's go with Grosjean. Let's go. Let's see what per, uh, Grosjean will qualify. Uh, as you can see on my main account, if you haven't checked out my main account video as yet, go check it out. Really awesome video. We have done, we have, uh, done some awesome testing on the tracks. And it seems to have paid off. So I now think my main account is like... Uh, exceptionally <laughs> uh, tuned right now it's just in a good position right now that's what I could say so now we're gonna be working on the junior account to get it leveled up get our drivers leveled up some more All 
our rival here is using boost. Alright. So we're going to use the same technique that we used on our main account. Here we're going to boost for one lap. We're not going to cut down. We're boosting for one entire lap. Uh, because Kimi has the tire management. He, he probably doesn't have the tire management at this level that he has at max level. But he has a high amount of tire management. Grosjean also has a high amount of tire management. So they can use this technique as well. And we've gained a few positions, so let's cut them down there. Cut down Kimi. Let's give Grosjean some support to get by Valerie Bottas and then cut him back down. And yeah. Alright, so Grosjean squeezed by Kimi also. Give him a little support and then cut back down there. Let's go to cinematics and enjoy uh, these laps. The rival probably be wondering. He burned up his Kimi. He's not gonna go for that extra lap. He's gonna go to pit. Yep, figure he was gonna go to pit. Well, we're gonna burn, push those tires to the limit, and do that extra lap. He went to hard tires in the middle. Is he doing the three? He if he's if he was trying to do the three, the three three two. He went to hard tires in the middle. He messed it up. So he'll have to conserve now for four laps on those hard tires. And he's using boost. So I guess he's not conserving for four laps. Our drivers are going to run out of tires. Uh, as they're not at a good level as our max drivers. But we're close to pit. So we're just boosting them into pit. Uh, from there. Into a fresh pair of soft tires. Which we're going to be doing the same thing. Boosting for one lap and come back to pit. Go Kimi, he's back out in 10th place. Grosjean pulling by Alban here. Really nice. Kimi pulling by that McLaren. Alright, so we're going to cut down right at the pit lane entrance. Right there. Uh, right there with Grosjean, with Kimi as well. And we're going to let our drivers go. Because we want to get two laps in there. And come back to soft tires in the six and boost to the finish from there. Pretty decent so far. We're way in the points here, 42 points. So you can use this technique if you th if you choose to. If you haven't done your races already, uh, you can use this technique. Or if you're going to be qualifying tomorrow, you can use this technique. As you can see, the tire management is a lot is a little bit better on our drivers this time around. Go back to pit to soft tires. He went back to hard tires on his Kimi. So Grosjean tire management is a lot better in this lap, in this stinge. We're still going to run out of tires before we reach to the pit lane, but we're going to be close, so we just boost in from there. Alright, Grosjean is going to be making it uh, to the pit lane without running out of tires while Kimi's out, so let's boost Kimi from there. Into those fresh pair of soft tires, and we're out there. With Orkimi now to boost to the finish. Out there with Grosjean. Now Kimi coming out. And he's back out in 8th place. And now to boost to the finish. Our rival should be uh, on low fuel right now. Because he was pushing uh, to keep up. Investing a lot of fuel. 
don't know what we're doing so we messed this tragedy up and now we're just taking advantage <laughs> nice Gojan got first place so it's a good a good thing that we didn't use uh, Perez as you can see Grosjean performed wonderfully here he's probably wondering how do we have so much fuel <laughs> let's give him a well done great race bro now to get uh, Kimi to get by AI Kimi here get that 43 currently at 42 can Kimi get around AI Kimi let's see yep got him nope he's defending holding his spot we should get him here yep so here we go 1 6 43 43 points that's a nice start Let's look at the briefing real quick. We got 35-6 with Grosjean. And we got a 37-6, 37-0 with our Kimi. We also got the fastest uh, pit time. This is why I'm always telling you guys, don't use, use Grosjean over Alban until Alban is at level 7. Once your Alban is at level 7, at that level he's better than a max level Grosjean. But until he reaches level 7, Grosjean is better than him. Nice tune there he's using. Uh, basically, he just needs to switch the slider and the blazer uh, to get it down to our tune. Though his tune is higher leveled, uh, we still managed to pull the win. Awesome. All right, let's get into our next race. Let's check if we're a race crate. No. All right. So we'll get the race crate at the end. All right. So let's go for Melbourne. We're still using Kimi and Grosjean. And then we're going to use uh, Hamilton for the Marina Bay. Alright, let me know down in the comments how you guys are doing uh, in, your, in your qualifiers. Alright, we're in the lead so far. Can we hold? Alright. So Grosjean fell off in qualifiers here at Melbourne hopefully he can make up some positions uh, with this boost start so we're gonna be boosting for one lap and then coming back to conserve for two same technique we just used rival using the split strategy here Grosjean gaining a few positions, four positions to be exact. See if he can gain any more. Kimi gained none, still at fourth place. And we're boosting for one lap. Grosjean gained another. See if he can gain one more. Alright, so we're going to cut down right there. right there so we're gonna now gonna conserve for two laps arrival seems to be confused he's boosting all over the place he's probably wondering what is he doing <laughs> using an old technique bro so I uh, I'm gonna be making a video about this technique and uh, the offshoot of this technique because this technique is two types. If you've been watching the Let's Play videos, you see me share the new technique 
uh, that's an offshoot of this technique that one is a lot faster uh, while well, this one is a is still fast but uh, fast at the right points and slow at the right points now to boost in Grosjean so he can try and create a little bit of a little bit of time between himself and the rest of the pack good amount of them should come to pit with Grosjean here so we should get out in a good position there we go back out in 13 now we're gonna boost for this lap the fort and then we're gonna cut back down now to conserve for this stench nice drive in from Kimi let's cut him back down there and let's cut Grosjean down right there Rival went to hard tires for his Alban, uh, so he's not looking to go back to pit with that Alban, but he would have to conserve uh, for four laps with that Alban. So once we come back out on into these soft tires, we should be able to catch up to that Alban and get by if not getting by we should be able to catch up nice distance here with Grosjean let's boost Kimi into pit now let's boost Grosjean into pit nice in and out there from Kimi let's see if Grosjean can get back out and yep eighth place nice and there he is catching up to seventh now just need to pull up on that Alban Kimi needs to pull away from these drivers and get that first place he's pushing that Alban now I don't know why Kimi is coming under pressure from Alban as he's on soft tires. Kimi needs to pull away here. There he goes. Now to pull in front, get first place. And put this race in the bag. What kind of driving is that from Kimi losing a position there in the last car on that corner? He's losing another position. <laughs> Crazy. Kimi lost two positions on those last corners. Uh, what's going on there? Let's close like that. Alright, so we got the fastest lap time. And the fastest pit time. Level 9. Grosjean with a level 6 Alban. looks good car set up a few max parts there and we managed to pull the win uh, using good strategy good techniques forcing the rival to make mistakes <laughs> and messing up his strategy all right so this is a nice start to our GP event let's go to our Next race, let's switch into Lewis Hamilton real quick. As this one is going to include some rain. Let's go. He 
So the code word for this video is going to be good strategy. So leave good strategy down below uh, to let us know that you made it to this portion of the video. Really appreciate you guys for all your support. And yeah, wet qualifiers. Let's get it in. So Hamilton should be pull, pulling away here. Oh man, so Hamilton came. Kimi out qualified Hamilton. <laughs> Kimi is just too good, bro. Too good for the game. All right, let's start off with a boost here. Then we go to conserve. All right, hold that inside line now, Hamilton. Hold that inside line. Nice. Nice. We got this, Kimmy. All right. Lewis trying to get that McLaren. All right, so he didn't get it. So let's cut down there. Go to conserve for three laps. While Kimi uh, start to defend. Holding up AI Kimi. Is that AI Kimi or is it Gio Nancy? Yep, it's AI Kimi. So we want or Kimi now to hold AI Kimi. So AI Kimi can hold the rest of the pack. While Hamilton take his time and pull away. But Kimi's is not slowing down at all. Rival trying to push his Grosjean around AI Kimi there. Is AI Kimi holding? Alright, so he got around AI Kimi. Pulling up now on R Kimi. See if we can defend. Kimi doing good. Holding him. Alright, so he got around or Kimi. He decided to cut and he started to boost again. So he can come and push our Hamilton. Put in our go to pit arters. Box, box, box. All right, so he pulled away. Nice use of boost there. And tire management from Grosjean. Let's give him a well done. We're going to take our time. He's not going to mess up our strategy. This is what this is what the discipline you need to stick to your technique. Don't worry about what your rival is doing too much. Just stick to your technique. Let's boost now into pit with Hamilton. Let Kimi conserve in. Then we can boost at the end. See if Kimi can get out. Yep. Alright, so we're now in our boost phase. And because our rival was boosting... Pushing his using a lot of fuel to get where he is. Where we now have more fuel than the rival. <laughs> there goes Hamilton getting around nice and easy. Doing a double overtake there. And here comes Kimi. He pushed his Grosjean to hard tires to do like a one stop. So he's not looking to go back to pit with that Grosjean. And we're gonna create distance. So we can go to pit nice and easy without losing any positions to that Grosjean. Switch to the inside. Nice. Hold that inside. Don't go. Damn. I was hoping that he would hold that inside line. He went wide there. So the rival went to pit with his Kimi to soft tires. If he wants to get three laps out of that Kimi with those soft tires, he'll have to conserve. If he boosts that Kimi, he's not going to get three laps. He's going to run out of tires on the last lap. Hamilton going to pit, taking a free stop. Fresh tires. And he's out there. 
Here comes Kimmy going to pit. Basically a free stop. He's back out in ninth place. Well done to the rival. Good luck, bro. Let's see the points. 38. So we're in the points here. Now let's go to cinematics. Lewis now up in second place. Screaming that he's low on fuel. Alright, so Lewis now is out of fuel. Cruising into the finish. Take a screenshot right there. Nice. One there as well. We can put together the thumbnail. Kimmy catching up to the rival. He's now up to six. He's out of fuel. Right there. And right there. Nice. Awesome race. We should get a race crate. Let's see what we get in the race crate. So a nice start to our GP here. In the challengers division. Kimi and Grosjean. First is Hamilton and he's using the Linda level 2. That pit time is really high on that tune. There we are. We're going to hold until later down. We finish up our GP qualifiers. Let's see what we get in this race crate. No bucks this time around. As Hamilton came into our shop, uh, I think yesterday, and we bought a few. No, it was yeah, it was Tuesday, and we bought a few. So we just need four more cards to get him up to level three. And yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Now, see you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs>